yourself onto any background uh, in a video using a green screen, just like meteorologists project themselves onto a map every night. Uh, first step would be to get a green screen and shoot some video with a green background. Um, if you don't know where to find one, I would uh, talk to your technology integrator and see if they can help you out. Uh, our kids have Chromebooks, so I'm going to show you how to do this on a Chromebook. If you have an iPad, there are some apps that work really slick, uh, but this will work as well. So you need to get your video into WeVideo. I usually just shoot it with WeVideo. And you need to do two steps. First, you take your green screen video and you put it on on a video two layer or a layer that is higher than whatever you want your background to be. Uh, then you click on the green video and you click on the little pencil button and this is the chrome uh, color key in section so you're going to click on that it kind of looks like a person with a green screen in the background. You click on the eyedropper and you select a color. Uh, it's going to take that color and pull it out of the background. So you see this did a pretty good job. Uh, you can make some adjustments to it if you'd like. Uh, but the background color, lighting is important, so you're going to want to test that a little bit before you shoot your final video. Um, I'm going to click Done Editing, and now you can see that uh, my internet's a little bit slow. Um, so I'm frozen, uh, but if I publish this video, I apologize, I'm at home right now. If I publish this video, uh, it would be me hanging out on the Great Wall of China. Um, so if you would like to superimpose yourself or your students onto uh, any background, uh, get a green screen and give it a try.